everyone, this is Powers. Um, so today, I don't exactly know what to say this video is, but, so, um, Lego City Adventures is this Lego show that was made from Lego City and was released first in 2019, and in 2021, we have gotten the third season. Um, I will say a little bit more about it in a few minutes, but first I was just gonna say, these are some of the two most used things in the series, and they, um, did become sets, uh, um, the set with the police officer came out in 2020, meanwhile, the other set next to it came out in 2019, when it first came out. So, first, there are many characters, um, in the show, and, and so here are two of them, and these are the two main characters. Duke Tatane is a cop. Um, the new top cop, as people call it. Um, like, if you think about Chase McCain or Tyler and his dog Chester, if you think about those, um, from the other years, he's the new top cop of 2019 and is going to 2021. I don't know who the next one is. I don't know how long he's going to get, because I actually don't know how long Tyler got. He was from 2012. He didn't really get a lot. He just got, like, a few, um, 30-second videos. And then Chase McCain got a long time, so who knows how long Duke Detain will have. <laughs> so, first with Duke Detain, um, he gets this, his cop outfit is really similar to Chase's. Like, really similar. And then, also, he has a new face. They also gave him a new hair. It's not that new because it came out two years ago, but... Um, the actual minifig did come out in the end of 2020, along with, uh, 2019, along with Freya McLeod, as I'll get to her in a second, but he has these black legs, and in the show, he has, like, little pockets on the side of his legs, and that's the only thing that he really has, and then, like, some pockets on the side of his, oh, um, over here and here, but, yeah, he also, he, I think he did a good job for his face, with the sunglasses and everything, Although, he only came in one set, and it came out last year, um, where he actually got um, a t-shirt. Because he actually always wears a t-shirt in the show, but they only give him this. But we just got a new version of him. I would have gotten it, but that set is huge. So, I don't think so. So that's Duke Detain and his car. Um, if you move that stuff a out of the way, um, you can notice that this set looks exactly like it is from the show. However, when you look at the side, it's, it looks kind of weird. Not like... Not that weird, but, like, it just looks like this is going way too down. But, like, if you look at it if, if different angles, like this, it looks like a really cool car. And then, put it like this, it looks even cooler. And also, if you can notice, on his license plate, says D3TA1N, and obviously that is detain, but with a few numbers, because it's supposed to be a license plate. Also, it's this is the same thing in the back. And then he also has this on the bottom, and his little cop thing. And also, the roof comes up, where he can go inside. I think this is actually the first car to get, like, a engine piece to go with it. So that's cool. But you always have to make him, like, push really far back if you want the thing to go on. Because if you put it forward, it does not close like this. Does, just doesn't work, so you just can push him back, and then you can put that. I like how we're getting these black wheels. I'm um, just saying, yes, most of these things came out a few years ago, so some of the stuff to you isn't that new. But I like the front, and then the side, I don't know, just even in the top, it looks, like, just incredible. And, I mean, like, I don't know what the side is, which just makes it look weird to me. I don't know what. But that's Stoop Detain, and the car that he uses from Season 2 because that came out last year, and you can check those episodes out. There are ten in total, and let's move to Freya McCloud. So Freya McCloud um, gets this um, truck, the Fire Chief truck. It actually says it on the side over there, Fire Chief truck. And that's me! And so, anyway, uh, so she gets a lot of different things in the series, she has a lot of different episodes, a lot about her, um, because she's, like, one of the second main people. Honestly, there are a lot more sets 
well, not a lot more, but a good amount of more sets that include things that they use a lot. But really, I mean, the characters are hard to get. And then also the things that are actually in the series are hard to get, and I don't know why they do that. But I like that they're sticking to the actual LEGO City theme. I honestly, I, I mean, I love LEGO City Adventures. However, I have a few problems with it. One, they only release one season a year. Two, uh, I just, like, I kind of miss the old LEGO City compared to this. Like, I kind of just kind of miss it. Like, their animation, their little shorts that they make. I don't know. I just kind of miss it. And then, just, I mean, like, some of the episodes, I mean, like, are kind of for, like, pointless reasons. And some of the episodes are kind of weird. But, I mean, they have a lot of funny lines. And they just, the characters are also funny. Like, you can only get so many of the characters and sets, though. However, we just got Top Hat Tom, so that's cool. And then, anyway, so she, uh, in the set that she got included in for the first time, she only got the hairpiece, her actual hairpiece. This one, she does use, but, like, they just made it this year. It's with her wearing the helmet on her hair. Um, but you can also get the one without it. And then also, this is her torso piece. I like that you can also use it on guy minifigures as well. And then she also came with a microphone in the set that she came in. So just keep in mind, this hairpiece does not get included in the set. However, the hairpiece that is all of her hair does include. Is included. <laughs> and so that's her. She also gets this in the set. And she also came with another firefighter. This set is $30.00. It may not be available because lately I've realized that Lego sets that are over a year old are getting retired. I thought it was two years, but really you only get a year and a half to buy a Lego set if you want it, so. Meh. Anyway, her fire truck, um, it's really cool. I like how they have the white wheels and then four different things on the side. The two cones, the fire chief on the side, fire chief thing on the front. Front, that showing the number of the set. Here, she also has her little things. It did come with a ladder, but I took that off. Also, it includes nothing in this one. However, it does include a bunch of water pieces for the hose. I took that piece off, but it's really fun. And then this piece comes out. It held the hose, but yeah. Also, it comes with an axe, and I love this little bumper sticker. I love video games. And if you have seen... Lego, Lego City Adventures Season 1, Episode 2. Um, you can see that for, like, a, a minute she was, like, playing video games. So that's nice that you can get that. So, um, getting to the show itself. So, for the actual show, um, I think it's really fun. It's got a lot of funny lines, good episodes. Um, and so, if you look at Season 1, it included 12 episodes. Um, and all of them are really good. I think that having Tippy being the bad guy was, like, really, like, I shouted at my TV when I found out that he was the bad guy. And actually, just saying, if you do not want any more spoilers, because I already gave you one, you should exit this video, because I will give out a few spoilers if you have not seen the show. But, anyway, so that's season one. Um... Only really the last three and four episodes really surrounded around Tippy being the bad guy and really the main ending. But I think they're all really fun. And then if you look at season two, it has ten episodes. And then if you look at season one and two, they both have uh, a Christmas episode. And that's cool. And I just love all of the stuff, everything. I like how we got new characters. And that came out last year. And then, also, if you look at season three, it recently came out, like, a few days ago, like, a week ago, and I'm just loving it. If you have seen it and you haven't seen the third season, check out Shirley Keeper P.I. episode three, because it is beyond funny. And Lesu cannot stand her voice, because her voice, I mean, like, it's, it's just a funny voice, but if you're, like, sensitive... Or, like, if your ears can hurt from that kind of voice, you, I don't know. Because, like, her voice is really just, I don't know how to explain it. But, anyway. So, she, um, 
I, I just love that character. I also love all the other characters. So far, we have 22 episodes for season um, 3. But actually, those are uh, you have two episodes for one episode. So, basically, it is 11 episodes so far. And I have no doubt they're going to make a Christmas episode. So, I'm pretty sure that we're going to get 12 episodes. And there's going to be a second one with it. So, that'll be interesting. Um... And honestly, overall, I think the show is great. I think they need to come up with new ideas for things. I think Lego. Uh, I think the third season was just really a really good season. Um, I really, I do not like how we have to wait so long for them. And I also, even if they have the regular Lego City Adventures, um, I just want to see one more of those mini movies that they made from those other things. But. Yeah, overall, I think it is an amazing show. I think we should get more sets with the minifigures. And we should get more sets that actually include the things that are in the show. So check out LEGO City Adventures. It is an amazing show for LEGO. I sell their best, but I really think it's great. So thank you for watching, thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe. Um, Thanks for everything. Check out LEGO City Adventures. And peace out.